Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we are talking about Abu Magomedov versus Bruno Vieira. Oop. Bruno Vieira. My God. Yeah. Bruno Vieira. Abu Magomedov, 26 wins, 6 losses, 1 draw, 3 and 2 in his last 5 fights. Got back on track against Wardley Alves. He showed a little bit more patience in this fight. His cardio still was weird. He still was able to... You know, put him, he put himself in bad positions at times. Minus 150 favorite, 6'2 with a 78 inch reach. Fighting, like I said, Bruno Vieira, who's 12 and 1. The one loss is Narsultan Rizabayov. Plus 125 underdog at 31 years old. 5'10 with a 72 inch reach. Jesus, 3 inch. Well, that's 1, 2, 3, 4 inches in height. 6 inches in reach for Abu. This is going to be an absolute bloodbath of a fight. Let's be honest. I think Abu can do uh, good things in this matchup as long as he keeps his distance. And you can't brawl with uh, a Bruno. We, we can't. 20 finishes. Has been finished four out of his six losses. 20 finishes, though. Does have 15 first-round finishes. Two and two in the UFC. Has one finish. And then he got finished the very next fight because they tried to Make him go against Sean Strickland. Made no sense. Bruno Vieira, the concern that I have with him is, you know, he has 12 finishes. Has been finished the one time, like I said. No decision wins. The problem is, is like Dustin Spolstice, even though he got the finish with nine seconds left, he was throwing a ton. And if Dustin could have survived the nine more seconds, I think it's a completely different fight. I think Dustin Spolstice does some really good things in that second to the third round. But the matter of the fact is, he didn't. D uh, Bruno Fierro was able to find the spinning back elbow, which was disgusting, absolutely disgusting. Didn't put him out cold, but he was hurt. Um, again, my issue with Abu all the time is when he gets tired, he's not a good fighter. He's not. When he's, he's like early in the rounds, he's awesome. So it's going to be a contrast. Can Abu keep the distance and still look really good with some output? Can he dig to the body early against Vieira and then make Vieira go longer into a fight? If he does, he wins. I don't think that's what happens. I think Bruno rushes him, throws bombs, and we see another Bruno Vieira finish. And as always, guys, subscribe, like, comment. Let me know you're picking. Peace.